hello guys welcome back to my channel yes yes i is the channel once again you know everything about this channel is uh, all about our application development android development and so on like that so uh here is another amazing and you know useful tutorial in sketchway that i brought to you a collapsing toolbar in sketchway how do you implement a collapsing or a collapsing toolbar in sketchway this is a tutorial a quick uh, you know easy and simple tutorial for you to know how to do that in your sketchway application and this is an example project i've made to see how this works can you see when it scroll down this toolbar is collapsed and when it is scrolled up it is fully fleshed to its position again so now i urge you guys you know to follow me as i teach you the step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do this in this amazing video tutorial so let's launch our schedule application here so this is it oh i have a couple of projects of media sorry let me create a new project collapse tool bar then you create your application now you yeah, we are here yeah, we are left with nothing absolutely nothing so now to do that you need to find your collapsing toolbar widget here can you see this is the widget here so you drag it to this place and this are the attributes that are editable for this collapsing toolbar so you come to the padding section of this collapsing toolbar then you delete and you know set the 8 to 0 back then now you need to drag a linear vertical layout and this is it then you set the attribute for this also the white attribute to match parent then you come to the padding section and set this to zero then you save it and again you need to drag a list view widget here and this is the list view component can you see drag it here then set this padding attribute also to zero so this is our world we need to test and implement our toolbar in sketchway so now let's come down back to here click on your list view then click on this inject attribute and click add this code mm, you need to add 100 uh, nested scrolling enabled is equal to true so yeah you can find it you don't need to worry about this code you can find these codes in the description box i have i have given you every code you are going to need in this project in the description box so you click on the save button to save this then you click on this linear layout then you click on this convert delete this away then you write these codes you can also find this one in the description box below that's core dot widget dot nested scroll view then you click on the you know save button wait click copy these codes because we are going to need it ahead of us in the next step so you click on save then in this inject area inject this you can also find this code in the description box below fill fill view but so you need to add these codes accordingly as i have done in this video sorry true then you click save so i think we are done on this part so click on this 
collapsing toolbar we need to add you know a background image to this collapsing toolbar so you click on this three dots icon and click on image then there's no image here in the project come to the you know can click on this plus button to add your image add to collection click on image then go to gallery to add your image well for me i am using this image then name it then save it go back sorry go back then set this background resource that is background image to this so can you see it is set mm, now what we are need to do make sure this padding of this is in zero so then you come to this event before you come to this event click this plus button click this library click and enable this app compact then go back now as i have said so you click this plus button then you click activity import then add on this activity import click it then click this button then drag this block then paste the codes i said you should copy earlier paste it so here it is now save go back come to this on create tab now come to the uh list tab add list string then a list then click add now add drag these blocks come to this control tab drag this repeat block write 50 then save add this inside choose list the list we added now come to this view block we are going to add items to the list view so we are doing this to add items to the list view we drag it earlier drag this block and drag this set this to list to bind to the list string we've added this list view to bind to the list view so you are setting the list view data so now you can just add your desired text i'm adding please subscribe to my channel then save to get more excitement and save now you go back click on save I, I think you are done now so i'll start saving then you run your project and wait till the comp project compiles completely it is compiling so you need to wait these are few questions you can answer while waiting 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 oh guys note this uh if you're a sketch beginner maybe perhaps you are a sketch a beginner and you're watching this video mm, i have helped you by dropping a link to the playlist of my videos you know sketch a beginners videos you know from zero to hero videos tutorial I've given the link to the playlist in the description box below so you can just navigate down to the description box below then you know click on the link to watch my videos you know yeah it is installed so try to install the application now So our application is, is installing now so you have to wait till it is so it installs finish installing now our application is installed finished oh, sorry so click on open to see how it works wow well wow this is great can you see 
when it is scrolled down it is collapsed and when it is scrolled up you know it is fully fleshed back to its but its position so uh i hope you love this and like this video my viewers uh as well as you know isaac way is made for you and you are made for me as well so i would like you to subscribe to this channel uh you know to get more exciting videos and tutorials and even more projects i uh, you know premium projects are going to you know be free on this channel i'm going to give you out give out free projects on this channel useful tutorials for free you just have to subscribe you know click on the notification bell to get updates on this channel and share within your friends uh eyes requires channel so uh wait for my next upcoming amazing tutorial like this one so i'll urge you stay tuned to my channel don't miss it if you have any comments you know if you have any questions or you know related questions or uh, you want to request a tutorial or a project or you want to make an application and you don't know how to go about it you can just you know do that in the comment section of this video i will reply to you as soon as possible you know trust me just try to you know just try to write your thoughts about what you want to do in the comment section of this video so see you guys in my next video tutorial have a nice and wonderful day goodbye